Hello, welcome to the online course on the statistical and demographic measures of migration. Um, in this course, um, I will uh, introduce you to the uh, statistics and the demographics of migration and how to collect data, how to uh, interpret uh, migration data. So the first session, which is this one, would be just an introduction to the course. So if you like the course, you can uh, join it. So uh, with more than uh, 270 million international migrants worldwide and about 800 million international migrants, uh, internal migrants, the estimated number of mobile population in the world is about 1.1 uh, billion. So this is equivalent to 14% uh, of the total population in the world. Uh, the, uh, the total population in the world is uh, 7.8 uh, billion nowadays. So, um, in fact, without reliable statistics on migration, socioeconomic policies uh, cannot succeed to reach their goals. No, the, the social and economic planners cannot plan without the needed data and uh, migration trends in order to plan for these uh, uh, movements and for the human mobility in general. Uh, this course is considered an introduction to the uh, demography of migration. So I, I don't promise you that you will be an expert in demography or in migration statistics by the end of this course, but uh, by the end of the course, I promise you to be able to identify migration data sources and also to read and understand the measurements or the meanings of migration statistics, rates, indicators, and also to be able to calculate main migration indicators. These are the uh, basic outcomes of this online course. Uh, if I move to the topics that I'm uh, going to cover, cover in the, within the uh, course, actually we're uh, going to uh, cover a, an array of topics. So first we're go gonna talk about the migration uh, population growth and regional disparities. The, I mean the, the uh, regional disparities in uh, migration and demography, uh, like demographic deficit and dem demographic surplus of specific regions in the world. Uh, second uh, uh, issue will be demographic concepts and definitions of migration, the basis for the uh, measurement. Uh, third will be typology of migration, means types of migration and types of human mobility, talking about the uh, uh, forced migration, uh, voluntary migration or economic migration and different types of uh, human mobility in general. Uh, then the uh, fourth topic will be data collection systems of migration and data collection systems. Actually, we have six main data collection systems, which are the first one is population census. Second is household surveys or surveys in general. Third will be population registers and fourth will be registers for foreigners. Uh, fifth will be administrative uh, data sources for migration. And the last one will be border statistics. Uh, fifth element or fifth topic that I'm going to cover is evaluation and estimation of migration data. The uh, sixth topic will be data analysis techniques, how to analyze migration data uh, using different uh, techniques, of course, uh, which this will include uh, how to calculate migration ratios, how to calculate migration rates, and also the uh, geographic, uh, graphical, sorry, uh, techniques of uh, presenting uh, population data as well as uh, migration data as well. With respect to the methodology of the, this course, this online course, um, a wide range of tools will be used during the uh, course, enabling uh, both transfer of knowledge from the trainer to the uh, participants, uh, in addition to exchange of experiences and learning by doing experiences or exercises. Uh, such tool will include uh, in particular uh, academic presentations or uh, these uh, like these presentations, case studies that I'm going to uh, post, um, graphical presentations as I mentioned, and demographic methods and demographic uh, techniques in uh, dealing with migration data. Uh, the schedule of the course, actually the uh, course is uh, composed of 12 uh, sessions. Uh, this is the first session of them, so uh, after this uh, first session, 
the uh, second uh, session will be devoted to migration and demography or the relation between migration and demography. The third will be devoted to the fundamentals of international migration. Uh, fourth uh, uh, and sixth sessions, uh, fifth sessions will be devoted to data collection systems, the six systems uh, I mentioned uh, before. Uh, and also uh, session six, seven, and eight will be devoted to the estimation of international migration statistics. The sessions nine, 10, and 11 will be devoted to the demographic techniques in the analysis of international migration. And the last session will be devoted to the uh, geographical, uh, uh, sorry, <laughs> uh, graphical techniques in the analysis of international migration data. Um, before starting uh, the uh, second session, I would like you to participate in the course by uh, taking the uh, pretest. Uh, the pretest is um, available uh, through a link. The link is available in the first comment uh, under this uh, video. So please subscribe to the, the uh, my uh, YouTube page and also uh, click the link to go to the uh, pretest, which is stored in Google Drive. And uh, in fact, the uh, the registration form and then the uh, pretest. So you will fill in. Uh, the, the ba your basic information, just uh, very few questions like just your email and your name and your affiliation and why you're interested in this course, and then we'll be directed uh, automatically to the uh, pretest. Take the, the pretest and keep it with you until uh, you get uh, the, the post test by the end of the course, and then you compare the uh, results of both and we'll give you the uh, ideal answers uh, for it by the end of the uh, course. Um, that's all for uh, now. Thank you very much and see you uh, in the second uh, video or second lecture.